Okay, Mark. So another Friday night fixture this weekend. Mm -hmm. uh, we're down in Northampton. What's been going on this week following last week's game against Exeter? Um, yeah, so we, we looked a little bit at Exeter and then also we've looked a tiny bit at the Northampton game two weeks ago. Um, and yeah, lot, lots to improve on, to be honest. But there, there's some good stuff. There's some good stuff there, and we'll, we'll look to bring that out on, uh, on Friday and hopefully um, get a good win. Does it bring any um, new challenges playing them during the open tests? Um, maybe just players that you haven't seen before included in the squad? Um, yeah, they, I mean, they've got a couple, but to be honest, they've got quite an experienced squad, actually. Um, so I think I'd like to think that most of us know quite a lot about their players and, and the rest of it, and that they probably know quite a lot about us as well. You know, everyone does their analysis in the end of the day. So, um, so yeah, I've been, been looking at players, sort of where to go at them, and I'm sure they've been doing the same same thing to us. And this weekend's fixtures are part of the, the Rainbow Aces campaign, which uh, a lot of our squad have got behind them and have shown their support on Friday night. Yeah, definitely. I, um, I was with the Sevens sort of two years ago and um, I think uh, we had a guy called Sam Stanley who was the first uh, ever rugby union player to come out as, as gay so yeah I mean it's not just about supporting him it's about supporting everyone and when I spoke to him before he was really wor worried about people's reactions but it's one of those things that I think everyone's come together and everyone will support someone in that in that situation and there's nothing to be worried about at all so yeah I think everyone's uh, proud to wear those laces and support the cause. And going back to the, sort of the on-field stuff so how important is it to get a result this week? Can sort of get a bit more momentum back behind what was a strong start of the season. Yeah, definitely. I mean, if we're looking at where we are now compared to where we were at the start of um, last season, we're in a pretty good place. But we're looking to build on that. You know, we're not not happy with where we are. Um, we would have liked to have obviously picked up some points against Exeter, but um, you know, we've got another challenge against Northampton this week, and we're, we're going there to hopefully get a win.